There you go, it's just a, a wee look at the um, two axis gimbal um, that came from uh, DYS. Again, uh, same as the camera gimbal that I did a small unboxing video of. Uh, that was a third axis gimbal, but uh, obviously this is a two axis controller. Um, I do believe that they, they are releasing um, a three axis, I believe, next week. But um, I'll have a quick look at this board. Um, made a few myself. And uh, this one seems to be very well made. I've tested it. Um, and it's working fine, no problems. Uh, this is the way it comes, already soldered. You've no real soldering to do unless you want to add obviously a few bits and pieces. One of the impressive parts that I did find with this gimbal is it comes with a, the, a button, as you can see there. That, I don't know if you can hear that, that you can actually. Uh, it to different um, parameters or whatever. Um, it comes preloaded with, believe it or not, Alex Moss software, which um, uh, obviously I don't can <laughs> don't really want to comment on. Um, not something that uh, I would. Um, yeah, we won't get into that topic. There's quite a few mem quite a few people out there using it. Um, the hot copy. Um, but as I said, it um, works. Does everything it's supposed to. Um, obviously, I'll leave the use as the individual user to make up your mind if that is something that you would like to buy or not as I said you can get it from DYS um, they're supposed to be releasing a um, third axis gimbal next week which um, is the second week in September 2013 um, no. We'll we'll test this on a on a on a spare gimbal that I have, and we'll report back and let you know how it's working. But uh, it's working fine, GUI. Everything else seems to be working perfectly. So, as I said, I'll let you guys make up your own mind whether you want to buy one or not. Um, thanks for watching. Bye bye.